RSL Insider presented by AT&T. I'm your host, Brian Dunseth. Three out Salt Lake back at training here at Zango Field following Saturday night's 1-0 win against Chivas USA, a match in which RSL played down a man for 66 minutes. Yeah, it's always tough when you go down a man, uh, but I think everybody kind of stepped up. Uh, we needed that extra 10% from everybody, and everybody put it in. Um, you know, it's, it's always tough uh, to play 60, 70 minutes without a man, but uh, I think everybody uh, did well. Um, we kept a, a nice high line, and we pressured their... their uh, players that had the ball it was uh, I think a fantastic adjustment that we made after I came out you know Schuler came in uh, and uh, for Arturo the guys backs were against the wall and they responded fantastically well um, tactically we had a few issues at the end of the first half but once we were able to come in at halftime and talk through exactly what we wanted to see exactly which passes we wanted to allow and exactly which ones we wanted to cut out uh, the guys stuck to the plan fantastically and worked extremely hard we were able to uh, get Fabi a little bit more mobile on offense, you know, and, and create uh, some possession. The attention now turns towards this Saturday night. Originally scheduled as a bye weekend because of international friendlies, it's a rescheduled makeup match against the Philadelphia Union. This weekend, it's going to be about who's not here for RSL because of international duty. You know, we're, we're missing so many players right now that uh, it, is, it causes us some, some real headaches. We're going to head into the game with uh, uh, the thinking and the idea that we may not be able to withstand any injuries or anybody pooping out in the midfield. Right now we have four healthy midfielders for the game and we're going to need a massive effort from all of those players and a massive effort from everybody uh, out there in order to get a result Saturday night. Uh, you know, when you have good players on your team, they're going to get called up and, and uh, we have to deal with that. Um, players are going to have to step up again, um, but it's nothing new to us. Um, so uh, it's not going to be an easy game. Philly's a great team and, and um, you know, training's going to set the tone for this weekend.